Hi, I'm Mark, a data scientist at DataRobot, and today we're doing a quick overview of how Shapley values, an idea with roots in game theory, are being applied in innovative ways to explain machine learning predictions. We'll start by understanding the problem that economist Lloyd Shapley wanted to solve when he introduced his work in 1953. Let's say that three friends, Ashley, Mark, and Thomas, are leaving the bar one night after work. They realize that they all live along the same route, so they can split an Uber ride home. But the distance between stops isn't evenly split, and the total cost is some complicated function of distance, duration, surge pricing, and tolls. What's the fairest way to split the contributions from each rider? Well, in this case, we should consider what the fare would be for each possible subset of riders. Ashley riding alone, Ashley and also Mark, Mark and Thomas but not Ashley, and so on and look at the marginal contribution to the cost when each rider joins the, each possible subset. Then, according to Shapley, the fairest contribution for each rider is their average marginal contribution over all these possible subsets. So what does this have to do with machine learning? Well, we can think of the riders as the features in our model, or the columns in the data set that we use to train the model, and the total cost of the car as the model output. Think of a particular use case for this. Let's think of a college where they have a model to predict the chance that an incoming freshman will graduate successfully. As you'd expect, the things going into the model are from the student transcripts and the college applications, so things like grade point average and how many sports teams they played on may all be relevant. Here are two students, Adam and Ben, who have the same predicted chance of graduating, 75%. They're in pretty good shape, but their advisor wants to know how they can increase their odds even more. By looking at the Shapley values for Adam, we see positive contribution from math and science courses and some negative influence from an SAT verbal score of 550. But in the case of Ben, we see a positive influence from SAT verbal score and AP English, but some minus contribution from middle of the road math grades. By looking at these different Shapley values, the advisor knows now to keep an eye on Adam's progress in writing classes and Ben's progress in math classes. This is just one example of the way that Shapley values can give us insight into the inner workings of a machine learning model and the kinds of insights that can generate. Machine learning models have already proven themselves capable of remarkable accuracy and usefulness. Now, we need ways to explain the predictions they make, and Shapley values are a great tool for developing explainable AI.